very heavy snow continuing to fall, especially right now across parts of southern Illinois. We're not done with it quite yet. Another few hours and we'll start seeing some of the snow exit to our north and our east. But uh, right now some pockets of heavy snow right on the northwest side of this area of low pressure. You can see the green color there, especially across southeastern Illinois. There is more rain mixing in. I just had a report though from a viewer out of Harrisburg saying that it has switched over to snow. So the color coding here uh, not exactly perfect, but uh, right now right across southeastern Illinois likely seeing a mixture of some rain mixed in with some snow. Farther to the west, it is all snow right now. Mount Vernon, Pinckneyville to Coin, and it's some of the heaviest right here in this band from Mount Vernon to Carbondale, West Frankfort, uh, say Cesar, Christopher, Ziegler, and then also westward into uh, parts of Jackson County from, say, the Virgins area back over towards Elkville and even into Marion right now, picking up on some very heavy snow. So we are going to see some additional accumulation when you get caught in one of those heavier bands. Well, the roads may not be bad going into it, but then they quickly get snow covered again. The uh, National Weather Service extending the winter storm warning a little farther to the south and east early this morning. Uh, we did have in the first round anywhere from two to three inches. I know that in Marion uh, was the case mainly on the yard. So uh, the criteria for a winter storm warning is for four inches or more. There's going to be some areas, especially right along Highway 45 and to the west, that we are going to be uh, three to four inches by the time it's all said and done later on this morning. Adding a few additional counties into that winter storm warning as well into southeast Missouri. But most of the snow here this morning is focused during the early morning hours by mid to late morning snow exit to our exits to our north and this afternoon temperatures above freezing. So while we do have some snow and slush covered roads right now, we should see some drastic improvements through the afternoon hours. Some flurries possible through the afternoon and even this evening an isolated snow shower too possible. Tomorrow afternoon just a cold blustery Thursday. Temperatures may struggle to get above freezing, but it is very short lived out of winter. By Friday we are climbing right back above freezing. In fact, by back into the low to mid 40s by Friday afternoon. These are live views coming in from across the region. You can see the areas right now picking up on the heavier snow. Uh, Metropolis 34 degrees, but not seeing much of that. But right outside our studio, well, there it is. A very heavy snow. Mount Vernon, uh, the interstate was clear just a little while ago. Not the case right now as uh, that heavy snow band is moving through there. Again, northwest side of the low is where we're seeing some of the heavier snow continuing to fall. This is about 45 minutes from now. Still snow in southern Illinois. Notice by mid to late morning, it's out of here. And this afternoon, uh, high temperatures, mid 30s. That's why we'll see roads improve quickly. But then this evening, another chance for a couple isolated snow showers. And then tonight, we'll drop back into the upper 20s overnight. And tomorrow morning, we could see some refreezing, mainly on untreated surfaces like uh, parking lots and sidewalks. We could see some ice develop first thing Thursday morning. Thursday afternoon, cold and blustery. Highs in the uh, upper 20s along the I-64 corridor and the lower 30s elsewhere. Again, additional uh, snow accumulation on top of what's already fallen. We still think one to three inches is pretty uh, widespread in southern Illinois, especially, uh, say, from to the west. Uh, farther to the east, right along the Ohio River. No additional accumulation is likely here through the remainder of this event. But a burst of heavy snow through about mid-morning. Should be out of here by noon. And then again, biggest impact, southwest Illinois, southeast Missouri. Much less in the way of impacts farther to the east and to the south. Tomorrow afternoon, some of us don't climb above freezing, but we will on Friday back into the mid-40s and then near 50 on Saturday. Saturday night brings our next storm system. It's going to be rain, though, Saturday night and into Sunday. So uh, the snow that's around right now, it's not going to be here for very long and the warmer temperatures and the rain will melt everything away. Looking ahead to next week, uh, highs only in the 30s and uh, we'll have that rain snow mix possible by the next Tuesday and Wednesday. Of course, we've got team coverage this morning. We're going to send it out to Storm Track 3's Emily Pike with the latest on road conditions.